Syracuse, New York, known also as Salt City, where our game is taking place today. Before we head down to the field for the coin toss, we'd like to remind you this game is brought to you by Coke Zero. Real Coke taste, zero calories. Enjoy everything. Both teams are lining up for the kickoff, and we're just about set to get this one underway. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. The quarterback brings his troops out onto the field for the first drive of the game. And he's tackled around the 28-yard line. Quick pass, tight end, and he wasn't ready for it. Number 85, the intended to play. Third and seven coming up here. Ball on their own 28. Slings it. He's at midfield. And they make the stop at about the 35. What a huge letdown by the defense on a big third down play. And that is just inexcusable. Fires up to his receiver. And he's taken down around the 29-yard line. Everybody enthusiastic. You can see the momentum that this offense is gaining. The coaches and the players on the sideline are fired up, and hey, it's a new set of down. And he tackles him hard at the 13-yard line. So they pick up quite a few yards on that play, Kirk. Well, that was an excellent route, and he did a great job of holding on to the football. Here's the eighth play of the series. Gets it out quickly. He goes out of bounds at the two. He showed some excellent moves out there. More than you usually expect from a tight end. That was a big gain, and this offense keeps humming along. Touchdown, Syracuse! the extra point. A nine-play, 76-yard drive, and they get it in for seven. So our score, 7-0. Syracuse lines up for the kickoff. He'll return it from the one. Rock down at the 17. Now the offense gets ready to take their first crack at it. Fires quickly to the tight end. Brought down right around the 28-yard line. Number 11 brings him down. It's first and 10. Ball on the 28-yard line. Fires out to his wideout. Tackle made around the 42-yard line. This is why it's so important to have success in running the football. It forces a defense to prepare for it, and then that creates chances on play action. They executed that one perfectly. Go on, go 
First and ten. Ball on their own 42. On the run, right side. Nice run to the outside. That makes it second and six. the gun so it's third down and they've got about two yards to go up the middle for a nice game fake and he's tackled right away there's the strike complete Kirk he's really got a lot of confidence in his receivers yeah I think he does but in this case I think he just threw it up for grabs he thinks his receiver can make the catch no matter how many guys are hanging on his back and he's level at the 20 a quarterback's best friend is a receiver he can count on to catch the ball every time he drops back the pass. This is the eighth play of this drive. From the 15-yard line, second down. They hand it off again, and he stopped behind the line. Well, the question now is, how will they respond after losing a couple on that run? That makes it for the Here's play number 10 on the drive. Pretty good stand there. They weren't fooled at all by the offensive play call. They'll line it up for the field goal. It's up, and it splits the uprights. Kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. He's to the 20. He gets out to about the 22-yard line. Let's find out if the defense has made any adjustments after giving up a touchdown on that last drive. So much of the passing game is about the timing between the quarterback and his wide receivers. And right now with this offense, they are in sync and really the timing and execution is flawed. They'll bring him down at the 28-yard line. Syracuse holds a four-point lead. And he throws it away. Great job by the defense at getting after that quarterback. And right now, I think they've got him with some happy feet. He appears to be a bit rattled. They need about three yards to get the first down here on third down. And they've got all their DBs in there to match up against the five wide set. It's a fumble. It's recovered. To the 20. He's tackled around the 17-yard line. Once the ball hits the ground, it's a matter of luck and will. And on that play, it was the defensive end who corralled it for his side. And while they are behind, they know they can knot things up in a heartbeat. It's way too early to change your game plan. Check, check 
quick throw to the tight end. Here's an opening. An exciting first quarter comes to an end. Syracuse up by four. Welcome back. Tight game here in the second quarter as we begin play. The offense can open this field up coming out in a five-wide set. And the defense counters with their dime look. And a quick throw. Touchdown, B.C. These guys need to be aware this aerial attack is capable of making some big plays. They've got to get on their toes. So the kicker will line up here and try to give his team a three-point lead with this extra point. And he tacks on the extra point. A quick two-play, 18-yard drive, and it results in a touchdown. Boston College gets set to kick this one away. From his own goal line, he's to the 20. He got hit hard. Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. Tackle that would be some pickup. yard line. It's first down. Throws it in a hurry. Touchdown, Orange. And he hits the PAT. This one away. It's fielded at the two. He gets out to about the 25-yard line. Right, this has been a great game to watch. A lot of competitive spirit out there. The offenses seem to be going up and down the field. Back and forth we go. I think the winner will be which defense can make that pivotal stop to secure a victory. There hasn't been too much daylight between these two teams. In games like this, some players try to press too much, and that can cause mistakes. He might not be able to get the pass off. Cross is left. Intercepted. Tackle at about the 31. Really nice cover skill shown here this time. That's exactly what you want to see from your young corners.
First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 31. Syracuse is up by four. Gains his way to the 20 yard line. Setting up blockers, the running back's got it on the screen. He's knocked out of bounds right around the 18 yard line. with a first and goal. Inside the 10 yard line because they have a knack for finding the opening. And then you can just drill it in there. He splits the uprights with the extra point. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. One deep. He's to the 20. And he makes it out to about the 24-yard line. And the offense will take the field, and they're certainly hoping to do better than they did on their last drive, which ended with a turnover. Anytime you give the ball away, it's a disappointment. So these guys want to show that they can hang on to it. That's a great tackle at the 36-yard line. That's good for a game of 12 yards. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 36-yard line. Taken down as he works the left for a nice game. That's good for a five yards. That brings him second and five. And he's tackled at the 50. From the 50, first down. Gains his way to the 39-yard line. That play was crisp. The route, the throw, the catch, that's fun to see. So it's second down now, and they need about yards to pick up the first. Defense goes with the extra defensive backs as the offense comes up five wide. Caught, and that's a first down. That's a gain of eight on the play. That makes it first and ten. They'll spread the field here. Let's see what the defense does with a five-wide outlook. Brad, I just think this quarterback's got to do a better job of being able to read that defense and make quicker decisions. And especially when the defense starts to get pressure, you've got to either get rid of that football or check it down or take off and run with it. Gonna hit the ground incomplete. Even though they didn't sack him, the pressure was still enough to force a bad pass. If you can get in there and disrupt the pocket, then the quarterback is gonna have a tougher time getting the ball to his playmakers. Delivers to the halfback on the screen. And they push him out around the 24-yard line. That screen play gets him a yard at the most. It's fourth down. They'll call on the field goal unit here for this long field goal attempt. 
And they can make this a one possession game with this kick right here. The kick is up. It's got the distance. And he splits the uprights. Boston College is lining up to kick this one off. He just drills this one. He's to the 20. And he's tackled at the 19-yard line. In a game that's this close, you can't afford to waste possessions. Syracuse is up by eight. Trying to get it to the tight end, but it falls Second down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 19. Here we go, The stop at the 31. When you can move the ball downfield in big chunks like that, you've got the defense right where you want it. Here we go. Yeah. And he's hit immediately. It's a great job here by the quarterback of recognizing the outside linebacker blitz and delivering the football for a first down. From their own 43-yard line. First down. He sails it long. Huge gain, and that sets him up nicely with a first and goal. Second down, goal to go. Ball on the six-yard line. And he shoved out of bounds just outside the goal line. Throws, and he's got a man. Touchdown. And some of the players are looking back because we have a penalty on the play. That penalty will move him back a bit. Yeah, with so many young guys out there, it happens happen occasionally. Fourth down. They'll line up for the field goal, and this is nothing more than a chip shot. Syracuse holds an eight-point advantage, and it's through the uprights. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. Excellent kick. He's to the 20. Brought down at the 25. So now both teams come trotting back out onto the field. to the tailback brought down right around the 30. Number six makes the tackle at the 30 yard line. That brings him second from their own 30 yard line. It's second down. We're halfway through and it's been a good one. Syracuse in front by 11. Glad to have you with us in the studio for the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Reese Davis and David Pollock here completely locked in on that first half. This lead at halftime is not insurmountable. You know, you watched the first half, and I really felt as if this team played hard. They played with a lot of energy and a lot of emotion. Just to be honest about it, David, the coaching staff seemed to be a half step behind. The other guy was ahead of them. They knew their tendencies. Second half, you expect to see them break some of those tendencies? Sometimes you have to. I mean, sometimes you come out and obviously you you put your game on tape. They, the coaches know what you're going to come out and what to expect from you. And sometimes quarterbacks, they don't like to push the ball down the field. They like to take the easy stuff. You got to take it away. Take away what they do best. And you could tell the first half, they weren't ready for what came their way. Now it's your, it's your job at the half to come in, 
put a plan together, be more aggressive. You're down two scores now. You can't afford to be cautious. Put something together to come out to have success in the second half. Just about time to get you back out for the second half. Brad and Kirk will be along in just a second. You're looking forward to keeping an eye on everything around the country here. We've got a good, well, a good game score. We're loaded. we got all the big screens going. You're going to be looking to hand out some helmet stickers later. Yeah, we loaded, man. I'll try. You think you can keep on your shoes in the second half? I'll try to. Are they stinky? <laughs> yes. Brad and Kirk, you're at a safe distance. Take it away. All right, Reese and David, thanks, guys. Second half action just about ready to start here. Taken from the three-yard line. And down he goes at the 25-yard line. There's got to be some sense of urgency to this offense right now. They don't have the luxury of wasting drives if they want to get back in the game. And down he goes, around the 26-yard line. From their own 26-yard line. Second down. Complete and he stopped yeah, immediately. Makes the reception. Gain of seven on the play. That makes it third and three. Fires to his tight end. Nothing doing. He looked like he just sort of aimed that one. Yeah, he didn't look very natural throwing the football there, and the result was an underthrow. That brings us fourth and three. Teams come trotting back out onto the field. Tackle made at the 40 yard line. like that the worst thing you want to do is just to throw the ball into coverage he got away with one right there he's very fortunate next time he should just throw it away out of bounds So that sack will back them up a little now. They're looking at a difficult third and 13. Hey, check Mike 34. Mike 34. Ready. Ready. Fly at 80. Fly. Motion. Motion. <laughs> Throws it to the halfback on the screen. And he's taken down at midfield. No gain on the play. Fourth down. Little too much leg into that punt. They'll bring it out to the 20. Not much luck the last time this offense had the ball. Down two possessions. This offense has to step up and capitalize on this possession. Tackle after a decent run up the gut. They need about three yards to get the here on second down. Right. 
He's to the 40. He's tackled at about the 45. He kept it himself and picked up a good-looking first down. Great execution and a good decision there by the quarterback. There are five wide receivers split out. The quarterback in the gun. Throws and it's incomplete. From their own 45-yard line, it's second down. tailback on the screen. He's taken down around the 49-yard line. Gets it quickly to the tight end, but it's dropped. This one off, and it's a beauty. This punt goes over the goal line, and this will be a touchback. So we're just about ready to return to action. He's under pressure. He's wrapped up for the sack. I think that one's on the offensive line. They've got to do a better job of holding their blocks, or else this quarterback's going to be pulling turf out of his face mask all game. So the sack makes this a second and long. Gets out to about the 15-yard line. Halfback's got it on the quick throw. Tackle right around the 24-yard line. Signals for a fair catch. Fair catch made at the 32 yard line. Let's see if this drive has a more rewarding conclusion than their last, which ended with a punt. If they're going to make a comeback in this game, it's going to have to start now. This offense has to get rolling. He's to the 40. He's at midfield. And they finally tackle him at the 43 yard line. That makes it first and 10. First and ten, ball on the 43-yard line. Nice run, and he's brought down. That makes it second and six. Quick throw. He's tackled at the 22. That was a really nice play on the ball by the receiver for a substantial gain and a first down. First down. From the 22 yard line, it's first down. He fights forward to about the 19. And this is still anyone's ball game as we head into the final quarter of play. 24-13, Syracuse. All right, we're just about set to start action here again in the fourth quarter. Easy, easy. Delta. 
Pulls it in, and he's in the open field. Brought down in the open field. That's a gain of four on the play. That makes it third and three. They need about three yards to get the first down here on third down. Nice run there. The offense coordinator has to be elated with the way his offense right now is executing. They're not in a hurry, but they're very, very methodical and very consistent with their approach. That's a third first down that they've picked up on this drive. it out to maybe the seven yard line. They're at the seven. Second down. Got a man open touchdown. Try for the two-point conversion. Quarterback all by himself in the backfield with five wideouts. He's under some heat. They don't get it. And he played 68-yard drive, but they just get six points after failing to convert for two. They line up to kick this one away. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. He's to the 20. Tackle made at the 32. A score here might effectively end this one. They go to the left for a nice game. run there by the tailback and it's good for the first i don't think there's a coach in the world who wouldn't be happy with getting five yards of carry just under three to go in regulation out of bounds around the 34 yard line Decision. That's a free timeout you just gave your opponent. You just gave it away. Poor decision making right there. So it's second and ten. Ball on the 20-yard line. And they may 
make the stop around the 17-yard line. The back gets three on the carry. You have to like how this linebacker was able to move up quickly and bring down the ball carrier for a short gain. Nice stop by the junior. Three, three, three. Just throws this one away. He gets it up, and it splits the uprights. Syracuse gets set to kick this one away. Fielded at the four. He makes it out to maybe the 23-yard line. Both teams realize that when the ball is snapped, we're one play away from a very different ball game. Just under two minutes in the game. He gets to about the 31-yard line. That makes it second and two. And he's tackled right away. Fires quick. He's got another one. Down at the 46. Number two with the tackle. We've got a first and ten. Ball on the 46. There's a strike complete. And he's shoved out of bounds at the 40. That's a gain of 14 yards on the play. First down. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 40. They spread the field in the gun with five wide receivers. He steps up at the 35-yard line. That brings him second and five. First and goal. Under a minute left. And they got it. Spikes the ball. Here's play number 10 on the drive. Outside the goal line. You know this is a real crucial time in the game. It could still go either way. And he hits him hard at the 10-yard line. The offensive line got a really good push there, allowing the back to pick up nine on the play. in the books and we saw a great one here today 27 19 
Syracuse. Kirk, go ahead and just give us your reflections on this game. I'm sad to see this one in because it was a great game to watch. Boston College played a good game out there, but they needed to make one or two more big plays, and they couldn't do it. Who knows? Another couple of minutes, and this one may have gone the other way. That's it for this presentation of NCAA Football 14. For Kirk Herbstreit, I'm Brad Nessler saying thanks, and we'll see you soon.